Okay, today I'm going to answer one of my students' questions. She asked me if we could take a graphic, like this little O over here, that I created in Illustrator. So I just created this and pasted it into InDesign. And she wanted, for example, to use this graphic and replace all the um, capital O's in, their, in her text. And she wanted to do this automatically. Well, you could do it manually just by doing a copy, control C, uh, putting your cursor in your uh, document and doing a paste. And this will give you an inline graphic or an anchored object, uh, which you can uh, manipulate. Let me undo that. Or you can do it for an entire document by using fine change. Uh, let me copy this again, make sure I got it. Control C. Now let's go to Find Change. So I'll just do a Control F. And okay, what do we want to find? We want to find, for example, just a capital O's. Let's click this little icon down here. This makes it case sensitive. And what do I want to change it to? Well, what I want to change it to, I go to my drop down list here and I go to other and I select clipboard contents. In this case, I don't think it matters if I use formatted or unformatted. So let's use formatted. And now uh, let's give it a try. So let's do a find, let's do a change. And there we go. So let's find the next. Finds the next. Change and find. Change and find. Change and find. Okay. So we see it works. And this also works in the grep dialog box too. If I go to grep, I do have that option down here. Under other, we have clipboard contents, formatted and unformatted. So that's it for today, and I'll see you next time.